guys doing? What's going on? I know I'm coming to you guys late night, but girl, the garden of gossip, they still chit-chatting, okay? We got some more stuff to talk about, and it has to deal with Nicki Minaj, Bob's. The blogs are talking, and it ain't good. You know, we're going to blame this on the, on the blogs, okay? Because they are exposing your girl. they trying to make her out to be like, you know, Nikki, you don't tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth when it concerns the petty. Yes, girl, it's more tea about her husband, Patty, okay? But before I go on and tell you guys to see, I just want to say thank y'all so much for welcoming me. I've been seeing the comments and the love and the warmth, and I just want to say thank you so much. It means so much, you know? Yeah. Mm hmm So anyway, make sure you guys like this video, share this video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, Gossip Girl, XOXO. <laughs> You know you love me, and I love you guys too. Welcome to the Garden of Gossip, here where we gossip and we talk about the rumors and the shade, girl. And we also go live on the Party Crashers channel, honey. But the forecast for tonight is shade. The blogs are throwing shade at Nicki Minaj. You know what's... That's why Nicki Minaj be mad at these blogs anyway. So anyway, I ain't say it, you know. I'm just telling y'all what's going on. So the blogs are pretty much saying that. Remember that time when Nicki Minaj, she went off with her husband. And then she came back talking about everybody wish they had the attention that Petty gets. You know, people was talking about her husband. I think it had to do with the barbs. And her fan base was talking about her husband. Her husband is disrespectful. He's not nice. He's not kind. And um, she said, you know what? He don't even hear none of y'all. He don't got to hear what none of y'all got to say. Because first of all, he's not on the internet. So he's not looking. He don't care. He's not even paying attention to what y'all saying. How y'all dragging him. He's not infected because he's not on the internet, you know? And she was going off like she's happy that she got a man that's not even interested in being like a celebrity or in an internet thing. And I thought it was kind of cute too, you know? I was like, go ahead. He don't, he have no interest in that, but girl, it's more to the story, okay? It's more like he can't get on the internet, yeah. Yeah, I mean, he can physically get on, but um, it's illegal for him to get on the internet. <laughs> nah, I don't know if y'all knew that, but um, I didn't know that until I, the blocks was hitting me up and let me know, because you know they notify you. So I got this notification, and it pretty much read that Nicki Minaj did not tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth when it contains to her husband, Patty, that remember back in November... Patty got arrested, pulled over for driving in Beverly Hills. Mind you, he just started to live in Beverly Hills because he moved there last year, right? So he got pulled over and he did not register to be a freaky offender, right? So in order, I guess, to him to leave off bond or whatever, they had to do a pretrial and a part of his situation was he cannot be on the internet so he couldn't be on the internet based on the judge order considering he did he failed to register in california as a freaky offender so they said that's the reason why patty is not on the internet because it was a judge order not necessarily because he don't want to be he can't be but could it be both uh, I bet they ain't think about that. It could be both, right? Couldn't it be that he's not interested in the internet? So he was like, okay, judge, put no internet. Shit, I ain't going to be interested in there anyway, you know? But I don't know. What do you guys believe? Do you guys believe that he's not on the internet because of court order? Or he's just not interested? Or maybe it's a little bit of both. Did you guys know that? I didn't know. And did you know something else? I don't know how true it is. But I heard, because you know when he was, um, I guess, he, he, he did register in California as a freaky offender. I did hear that right now he's pleading, you know, 
to get back on the internet. So it seemed like he wanted to get back on the internet. So he may be on the internet real soon. And also, they were saying that, because when he registered, I guess you got to put the address where you're staying at, which is Nicki Minaj place. But girl, guess what? People are saying that some of her fans actually put her address out, okay? Now, I don't know exactly what happened, but they said it had to do something. I don't know. Y'all know the story. Can y'all please comment in the comment section? I know I heard another story where they said Nicki Minaj fans, um, pretty much they was delivering Domino's pizza. Okay? To some celebrity. I don't know if it was Cardi B or it was Nicki. It was somebody. And I heard that they was leaking Nicki Minaj address. But people may say, well, her dress was already out due to her husband being a freaky offender, how he had to register, but they are saying that the address was out before it went public, that he's a freaky offender. People are saying they just don't like Petty, which is Nicki Minaj's husband, and this is coming from her own fan base. So I don't know how that's going to, you know, happen. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. I don't know if they dislike him based on his history or they dislike him based on how he is around them when, you know, when they go to the concerts and, you know, out and about working. I don't know. Or is it because what he said in the past? I, I know people say he said some problematic things. I don't know. I didn't hear it. I didn't watch it, the video, so I don't know. But I was just here. In the garden of gossip, you know, talking to the flowers, you know, talking to the birds. And they was like, you know what? You need to put this tea out. So I had to gossip with you guys and let y'all know what was going on with Miss Nikki Petty. And guess what? We may see a whole different vibe when Petty get on this internet. Now, when Petty gets on the internet... How far would it go? Do you think he's actually going to get on the internet? Is he going to have an Instagram? If he's going to have a Twitter? And we already know Nicki Minaj, she does have enemies. Do you feel like her enemies is going to hit him up if he's accessible? Because once you get a DM, a Twitter, you know, Facebook account. I don't think they'd be on Facebook, but maybe Snap. Snap and Insta, you know. I wonder if Nicki Minaj going to have to look through them DMs. Do you think he's that faithful? You think that he's that loyal? I don't know. I mean, even though he's a freaky offender, we do know it's going to be so many girls that still going to be down for him and still going to want him, you know, just because. So that would be interesting to see where would that go and to see what is his end game. Is do he really love Nicki Minaj or do he have another end game, you know? Shit. Even though he's a freaky offender, this is Hollywood, and this is reality TV, and this is Atlanta. They definitely uh, pick him up for a deal, just like they did Safari. He's set for life. Whether he's be with Nikki or if he break up with Nikki, his ass already set, okay? No matter how he move, he got options, okay? Unless he go back to, to the big house, you know? But anyway, comment, let us know what you guys think about this. And I will see you guys tomorrow. All right? So I love you guys, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Uh, you know what? I will be going live. I know y'all going to be asleep, but um, party crashes. We'll be going live over there tonight, and we're going to talk about, damn, that boxer guy. It's more footage that's coming out about the boxer guy. They got him about to put the paws on his baby mama. He's about to fight with another man because another man was videotaping it and he got into it with that man. And they did say he was punching, you know, he was, he was going to punch her, but I guess he just got to that jaw because, you know, she had a broken jaw and something else in her face was broken. Shit, we just got finished talking about Young Bird. I did a video about it and it's sad. Yeah. Broke that girl nose. She got scars all over her body. The pictures are horrible. And she's a beautiful girl you would never think. You know, when you see the before and after picture, to see the picture before she was, you know, got the paws on after. 
Well, I tell you, it's like a whole different person. It's a whole different person. But um, hopefully she does heal. And um, she, hopefully she knows, her, she she learns to know her worth. I think it's, um, it takes time. You know, it definitely takes time to know your worth. It's not going to happen overnight, you know. Even if she do, you know, even if he does break her nose, it is a process to heal from that. Because you not only have to heal from that, you have to heal from your past that caused you to be in this situation. You have to know your future, where you're going to be headed. You know, it's a lot. It's a process. So hopefully she's going to get professional help. And it comes from her suing that man and getting that millions of dollars so she can get the best care and the best help mentally she can because she needs it. You know, he definitely needs it, but she needs it too. Everybody needs it, okay? Especially if you've been going through stuff and, or whatever, you know. Some people just feel like they can just hear some good music and just give it some time and they'll forget about it. You need to talk that thing out. You need to understand. You need to go back to your childhood. You need to figure out why you act, why you react, how you feel. You need to, girl, you know, the mind is so deep. Please don't take it for granted. And please don't make it so damn shallow. It's really deep, you know. But comment, I'm going to leave out because, you know, I talk forever. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys sooner than later. Bye.